Hello HP Touchpad users, great news. Our talented developer, JC Sellens, is at it again. This time with his own Cyanogen Mod 10.1 ROM with partial Bluetooth support. That's right, Cyanogen Mod 10.1 on the HP Touchpad with Bluetooth support. Functionality is limited currently in this build, but this, as always, is the precursor to Bluetooth support showing up in other builds. So as this improves, you'll see new builds, hopefully, from JC Sellens. Big thank you to him for his continued support with the HP Touchpad. You can see here my version number. Little Easter egg if you click it. Hi, Sid. So fantastic to see. Now I'd highly recommend making an Android backup before testing this out and leaving a little feedback in the forums for JC Sellens. There'll be a links in the description of the video for this new build. This is a testing build and you can flash it through Clockwork Mod. We'll show you that shortly. And you can get it from his testing folder. There will be links in the video's description to try this out. You'll simply download it to your device and dirty flash it over your current ROM. Let's show you how to install it now. Simply reboot your device and go to your recovery. Once in recovery, I highly recommend you make an Android backup. This is a complete system image of everything on your device. Simply go down to Backup and Restore, and the top option, the very first one, will be Backup. You'll simply click the Home button on that and it'll make a complete backup for you. Once you've tested out the ROM and want to get back to your previous version, you'll simply go to Restore and select the ROM from the list and flash it back. It's a 100% surefire, safe way to install and back up your ROMs. Now that we're backed up, we're going to wipe our cache partition. Yes, wipe cache. Next, we'll go to Advanced. Wipe the Delvic cache. Yes, wipe cache. And now we're ready to install our ROM. Go to Install Zip from SD Card. Choose Zip from SD Card and navigate to the location of your experimental ROM. Select it and install. Now that our ROM is installed, we'll reflash our GApps. Choose Zip from SD Card. Find your GApps and flash it. Yes, install GApps. Now that GApps is installed, we're ready to go back, reboot our device, and test out our new ROM. Please subscribe to see the latest updates with Cyanogen Mod 10, 10.1, everything touchpad related. Thanks for watching, everyone.